I challenged all participants in the IGF to live up to their words, to walk the talk. Um, I asked for a specific space on the IGF website for commitments. And I made a number of commitments on behalf of Team UK. I didn't speak as a minister or for government, but on behalf of the UK team. But ministers have backed those commitments and we've reported back as promised during course of panels uh, this week. Uh, we've established the United Kingdom IGF uh, so that we debate issues at a national level. And one of the big developments that I'm really pleased about, for instance, was the seminar this morning uh, when we talked about the patterns at different national levels where people are doing work to bring work together uh, to this event. In other words, industry, parliamentarians, uh, governments, uh, and civil society working at a national level in order that we come together uh, with issues to be discussed at the international level. Um, similarly, uh, we promised to work on things like crime reduction and best practice and we brought back things back for that. My point in saying this is that the challenge is not what people say in a discussion like this, but what we do in between to make sure that there is a cooperative approach, that we have business, we have governments, we have civil society engaged in the future of something that is absolutely crucial and important to all of us. But I also said uh, last year, can we increase the engagement of mainstream industry? I think that's important. We need people at a chief executive level in industries across the world, not necessarily to be here, but to realize that this is important to support the process in their own countries and to support the process here. But finally, what about governmental engagements? Governments signed up to the IGF process during the course of the World Summit at Tunis. It's not enough for governments to sign up to it and then stand back and say we wait for it to, uh, to fail. Governments have to support the process. That means they have to be involved with the other partners at their own national level. I'm pleased to say ours is, and some others are as well. Uh, but I think we have to challenge all governments not simply to stand back and wait for the IGF process to fail, but say that actually working together is not just more complicated and involve most talking. It's actually the best way to do things, and it's the only way to do things in the joined up nature of the network. Cooperation, working together, is the only way to design a new form of governments. Falling back on the old form of governments simply will not work. Thank you, Alan.